Now we are doing exercise 3.1, question number 2, Roman number 11. So Roman number 11, we have, let me write down the question. Question is, question number 2, Roman number 11, factorize the following, x to the power 6, whole into y to the power 4, minus z to the power 4, close the bracket, plus y to the power 6, whole into z to the power 4, minus x to the power 4 plus z to the power 6 whole into x to the power 4 minus y to the power 4 solution this is our question so first step what am i going to do is multiply right so multiply this number okay first let me keep this one as it is so x to the power 6 y to the power 4 minus z to the power 4 keep this one as it is this one into this one multiply y to the power 6 into z to the power 4 minus y to the power 6 into x to the power 4 plus z to the power 6 into x to the power 4 plus minus minus z to the power 6 into y to the power 4 now x to the power 6 y to the power 4 minus z to the power 4 and now you need to take commons right so y to the power 4 minus z to the power 4 you must take y minus z common if possible so where you can take is if i take from this two okay take common from this two you can take y to the power 4 common and z to the power 4 common so from here z to the power 4 goes y to the power 4 goes what's left out is y square and from here z to the power 4 goes y to the power 4 goes so what's left out z to the power 6 so z to the power square right minus from these two we can take common that is let us take x to the power 4 common plus x to the power 4 if i take x to the power 4 only it will be z minus 6 y z minus y so let us take minus x to the power 4 common if i take minus x to the power 4 common what's left out here y to the power 6 minus from here z to the power 6 so x to the power 6 y to the power 4 minus z to the power 4 and all these things so i can write down x to the power 6 y to the power 4 and z to the power 4 okay let me take y square z square common if i take y square z square y square minus z square common from this first one what's left out is x to the power 6 it's left out from here into from here these two i have taken y square and z square common so what's left out will be y square minus z square taken common so it will be y square plus z square will be left out here plus from these two i have taken out this one common so y to the power 4 z to the power 4 is left out and from this one i have taken x y square and z square common this one okay this one i can write down as y to the power 6 x to z to the power 6 y square whole cube minus z square whole cube and y cube z cube i can write down as y square minus z square y to the power y to the power 4 plus y square z square plus z to the power 4 i can write down this one like this right so i have taken out this one common what's left out is this one so let me rub this one and copy this one so i'm going to write here y to the power 4 so x to the power 4 into this one y to the power 4 plus y square z square plus z to the power 4 okay now let me rough this one i hope you understood this concept it's not that complicated you may find it little but not that much now okay so i have taken y square z square common so write down y square minus z square common and now from inside you multiply all this and you are going to get x to the power 6 y square plus x to the power 6 z square plus from this one y to the power 4 z to the power 4 minus x to the power 4 into y to the power 4 it will be x to the power 4 y to the power 4 minus into plus it is minus x to the power 4 y square z square 
and if I multiply by x to the power 4 again it will be minus x to the power 4 z to the power 4 right now y square minus z square I have taken out common now I have to take another thing common so what is that what can I take common next right so y minus z I have taken common so let us try to take z minus x or x minus y okay let us try, try x minus y so if I take this one and this one common okay from these two if I take common it will be x to the power 4 will be common and y square will be common if I take x to the power 4 common from here what's left out is x square y square taken out from here taken x square and y square common so what's left out here is minus y square and next if I take common from this one x to the power 6 z square and x to the power 6 z square and somewhere from here okay if I take out common from this two this one here this one and this one what what I can take common is plus x to the power 4 can be taken out common and z square can be taken out common from here what's left out is x square and here what's left out is y square and I have this two and from this two if I take z to the power 4 common what's left out is from here y to the power 4 and from here z to the power 4 uh, x to the power 4 so let me take minus common right so if I take minus z to the power 4 common from these two what can I write down is x to the power 4 minus y to the power 4 okay this much let me close the bracket so y square minus z square put in the bracket and from these two I can take x square minus y square common so x square minus y square also taken out common after taking this one common what's left out I write it down that is so from let me put another bracket x to the power 4 y square plus x to the power 4 z square taking out this common okay from here it is x to the power 4 minus y to the power 4 so from here I've taken an x square and y square common so what's left out will be z to the power 4 x square plus y square okay and y square minus z square x square minus y square and from this one and okay let me multiply x to the power 4 y square plus x to the power 4 z square minus x square z to the power 4 minus y square z to the power 4 okay so now let me rough this one the first one And after roughing up this one, okay. Now let me write down here. Now let me rough the question also, not important, right? Okay, now what I can write down is copy that one y square minus okay. Let me copy in order that is x square minus y square x square minus y square and next that will be y square minus z square okay and from this I can take common there are something that we can take common from this one x to the power 4 if I take from this one and this one if I take y square common from first one this one and this last one okay if I take y square common from x to the power 4 minus z to the power 4 and from these two if I take x square plus what can I take common is I can take x square and z square common if I take that it will be x minus z so let me rough and take minus also common and if I take minus x square z square common then it will be x square minus z square x square and z square if I take common it will be x square minus sorry I can take plus here x square minus z square this will be the common one now x square minus y square y square minus z square and from this one I can take x to the x square minus z square common 
If I take that, what's left out will be y square. This one, x square plus y z square will be left out plus x square z square. Now I can write down this one as x square minus y square, y square minus z square. And I think the book has given z square minus x square. So write down z square minus x square. x square minus z square, you are writing down like this. So one negative sign, put it here. Okay. And this one inside one, you write down in bracket. That is y square, x square, y square. You can write down this one as x square, y square plus y square into y square. It will be, this is z square, I think. Uh, z square into y square it will be y square z square plus x square z square so x square y square y square z square and z square x square and this is your answer i hope okay i hope this one is the correct one that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video